Hey folks, Iron Ginkgo here. Today I'm going to do something a bit different. I'm going to do an, uh, a review or an overview or uh, my first opinion, uh, my first thoughts on these Golden Retriever soft toe work boots. Now the first thing I noticed was the name. Golden Retriever. Now, I've only had these for two days, a day and a half. My buddy just purchased them yesterday at an Army Navy surplus store. Um, bought it for about 89 bucks. I think after tax he paid all together about $94 for it. So I think it was a good deal. So I did some research in my, li my limited amount of time, and I hadn't found much, to be honest. Um, <clears throat> I asked the guy at the store if he knew anything about him. He said that uh, um, the people who run this company broke off from two other companies. I know one's Carolina, and uh, the other one I can't remember if it was Bates or Danner. But these guys broke off and made their own company. Now what he told me is these are made out of buffalo hide. So they're a bit tougher than, than normal cow hide. And that's my favorite thing about these. They've got your um, standard work boot sole. Um, Golden Retriever makes these soles, I guess. Um, put their name on it. It's oil resistant. Um, I guess it's a good sole. I mean... They're all about the same unless you get Vibram. Vibram was the absolute best. They're they're a solid shoe. You know, I've I've been working on them here for the past two hours. I I, uh, I treated the leather with some old motor oil. Um, I didn't I couldn't in the limited amount of time I couldn't find uh, some good wax. I know I've got some laying around somewhere, but I just couldn't find it. So I went in I went into the garage here and. And I uh, just found some old, some old motor oil, and I, I lathered them down, and it, I mean, they look good. They smell good. I love the way that smells. Um, yeah, they've got, they've got nice, thick, insulated walls. It'll probably be real, real warm in the winter. Um, wear some, some thin socks, and you'll be all right in the summer. Um, they've got nice padded insoles on the, on the heel in there. The tongue's real thick. Um, they've got this nice uh, back strap, I call it. Give you some, some ankle support, some more ankle support. Um, I, I like them real simple, not too many crazy laces. I mean, like I've, I've got on mine, I've got some, some laces here and um, mine are relatively simple, but these, these are much more simple. Um, and, and I like that. Uh, with me, simplicity is the key. Um, the, you know, the more crap you've got going on in something, the more likely it is to break or fail or, you know what I mean. Um, but anyways, I, I like these. They're nice. Uh, when these goes, my, my Timberlands, I've had them for about three years now. When those go, I'll probably get some Golden Retrievers. Uh, but these are good boots too. Maybe I'll do a, a review on these. But anyway, guys, thanks for watching. I uh, can't wait to get these on my buddy and see what he thinks. Oh, also, I took the the maroon and gold laces off and threw the black ones on there. He's he's not much for work works like he he. I, I like industrial work style. Um, that's just my preference. But he's he's more of a tactical guy. So I, I think you'll like those black laces. Almost kind of makes it look like a like a a combat boot almost. But anyway, guys, I I, I think I'm gonna do uh, a review on on these boots and the new knife I got. Uh, thanks for watching.